Check. 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 Yo, 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 what's good? It's your brother Breezy Brainstorm, and we here with episode 168 of the Hip Hop Brief of the Week. This week, we checking in with King Kunta. That's King Kunta by Kendrick Lamar off the Pimp a Butterfly, this fire baseline groove. We're talking about P Funk levels, a groove. Definitely had to tap into this one. It's fairly simple. It's real groovy. I love it. It's something you can just put in your practice routine just to let them know you got it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but before we get into this riff in E minor, I'm going to need y'all to click the link in the description, like, and subscribe on this video and channel. And if you have any riffs that you would like to see done, use the link in the description for the riff of the week request form. If you want to show some love, cop some merch. All of that is in the link in the description. All the links are there. Go check out the music. Links are there. You know what I'm saying? Just show some love. Send a couple of duck at your brother's way. The links is there with the Cash App and Spotify. I appreciate y'all. But now we're going to get back into this riff. The first note of this riff is E by way of a hammer on from D to E. And this is riff is an E minor. And we're using the E on the three, five, seventh fret and hammering on from D on the fifth fret. Now, and this is on the on the A string. Now, once we hammer on at E, we're immediately gonna go to the lower octave, which is the lowest note we have, which is the E string. And when we're hitting that E string, we have our, our left hand free to go down to F sharp. F sharp to G. to A, now from A to B, we're going to hammer on A to B, then back to A, then slide the A back to G. So that's the first part of the riff. That is the part, that's the main part of the riff. Now, as it goes around for three bars, the fourth bar is the turnaround. And there's two turnarounds in this song. The first turnaround is this. Hold on, my bad. <laughs> Let's run it back. So it's essentially the same notes that uh, you played from the beginning, the hammer roll from D to E, back to D. Then you just hop up to the, the E string and hammer roll from A to B. Then rest on it. Now it kind of goes, but it's a dead note. If you listen, you can kind of hear the. So if you want, you can just go and just hit a dead note there, but I kind of heard it. You can tell me if I'm tripping or not. I heard. Then back to the one. So that's the first turnaround. Once we go through that three times, the second turnaround is this. So let's just do it slowly so we can lead into uh, the second turnaround. So as you notice, when we go to the hammer on the D, E, then the, um, the E string, when we were on this F sharp, we go F sharp, then F sharp, the F sharp one more time, then G. <laughs> Try to catch the rhythm. 
The second time we go around, it goes. Just one. Because it quickly goes up to the octave F sharp. Now F sharp up to the um, to the D to the um, A sharp. Once we hit this um, A sharp or B flat or whatever you want to call it, um, we do a hammer on from the G to the A back to G, then back to business as usual. So let's do that one more time in motion with me not talking, the, just the, um, the second turnaround. Hold on, hold on. Because you have to remember, you're not going. You're going. nasty so so in order to kind of make that work um, I'm using my my index finger on the F sharp every time and then I move up my index finger to G and I use my middle finger to hit the, the octave of sharp my ring finger to go to uh, D yes D and then I use my ring finger just to hop up from that D to the P flat. Because then I can use my index finger to go back to G because I'm going to hammer on to A. Then my index finger will already be at G, which is what we've been doing before. And we can just go back to. So, in all in all, we have this. I'll do the whole thing a bit slower. One, two, here we go. That's the riff. Then we spin that back around. Funky, super ass funky line. Super duper funky. I love it. It's a great riff. One of my favorite riffs out of all the riffs we've done. This has got to be one of my favorite ones. That King Kunta, that funkadelic vibe for real, for real. Super smooth, extra on the groove. Thank you very much. <laughs> it's your brother Breezy Brainstorm. Thank you for tuning in. We were at episode 168. We almost had 175, you know. Almost got a quarter left to the 200. And that's another accomplishment, man. So I appreciate y'all tuning in and sticking with me for this journey. We got a lot more riffs to dig into. Keep the requests coming. Check the link in the description if you have something to request as well. I'm going to catch you on the flip side. Peace. Talking now. Talking now. Talking now. Talking now. Talking now.